Hey guys, Gamer Edie here again. I'm actually testing out a new microphone. Um, I got a new, a different mic. The uh, the microphone that I was using earlier was a um, just the regular iPod or iPhone mic, but now I'm using a microphone that is the Tascam IM2. I'm going to turn the limiter off because I don't think I need it right now. Although I may play with that later. <clears throat> Pardon me. And my level, turn my level up, no, my level up. There we go. Check, check, check. Such awesome radio. So yeah, this is uh, the Tascam IM2. I actually have another mic that's coming in the mail, hopefully tomorrow. But I kind of wanted to have this on the feed just so I could do a compare, what they would call an AB. I want to AB this mic to the other mic to the I phone mic because one of the challenges technically I don't know if you care about this but maybe you do when you're dealing with especially with brand new technology and you're trying to take it to something like PAX something about PAX if you've never been there and it's the same thing it's even worse actually for E3 it's freaking loud I mean you can't believe how loud it is it inundates your senses and E3 is is just beyond beyond but PAX is very very loud so you kind of get this situation where I'm trying to do interviews, but if you're just using a regular mic um, that's not unidirectional, meaning it only ex takes in sound coming from one direction, so you kind of point it at somebody's mouth and it picks up what's coming out of the mouth, but not everything around, you know, from behind you and all the screaming and the, the, the stuff that's going on on the floor. That's what you need is a unidirectional. Now, um, Sometimes people will use stereo mics. I think it's a bad idea because inherently with a stereo mic, what a stereo mic is going to do is it's going to pick up two different sides. Um, and you want to keep, as far as I'm concerned, the, 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 I guess you'd call it the cloud of sound that is actually being brought to the forefront in as narrow a space as possible because there's so much noise there. In some cases, in, I don't know if you, well, if you ever heard any of the other interviews that we've done at PAX, I've done it on a handheld um, digital recorder. And sometimes it was so loud in there that I didn't really know what the person that I was interviewing said until after I got home and listened to the recording. It's that loud. But um, so that's kind of the key is actually making it sound better than what I'm even hearing on the floor. And that's where unidirectional comes in. This one is not unidirectional. Um, in fact, there's two different sides to it. It's a stereo mic. I'm not so quite so sure. I guess it's cartoid, I guess it is. Cartoid stereo, which means it's, yeah, I guess it would be cartoid because it's, yeah, makes sense if I'm looking at it. So, um, yeah, I'm, I'm holding it in multiple different ways to seeing how it might sound in different positions, if it sounds better in position A, or it better in position B, or better in position C. Um, I guess that's it, and I'm gonna leave this on the feed. I apologize in advance. I wanna leave it on the feed for as long as I can, um, well, at least until I get the other mic. Um, there's gonna be another mic coming. Oh, there's multiple adjustments on this. Great. Um, there's going to be another mic coming in, like I said, in the in the mail tomorrow, and, and I'm going to be comparing what the, things sound like. I've heard really good things. I've seen some video reviews on it on Amazon, and pretty convincing that it's good for cutting down the amount of sound um, surrounding you so that you can just hear the voice. Because, you know, what's the point of having an interview if you can't actually hear what anybody's saying? So anyway, that's it. Um still really excited about PAX and I'm really 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 excited to have you listeners with me on this stream asking questions right alongside me because when this happens there is the chat you can send me messages and even as you hear someone say something you will be able to chat right away it'll come right up on our screen and we'll be able to see it and, and call them on it if you know something that clearly we didn't if you're screaming at the I mean I've, I've done that hundreds of times you're interviewing somebody and or you're watching an interview or listening to an interview and they're not asking the question you want to ask this is your opportunity for games like saints row for games like um um the dlc for um um uh, uh dishonored god i'm having a brain fart 
just all those things. It's like, it's, it's so nice to have you feeling, me feeling like you are there with us, not only just in spirit, but also your brains, your minds, because the Game Hounds community is full of some of the funniest, smartest minds, as far as I'm concerned, in the game hound or in the podcast listening and the gaming listening world so we're not only going to be there for us we're going to be there for you as the mouths to your brains so anyway it's going to be really awesome and um i think it's a pretty good test of this mic don't you anyway talk to you later bye